Good afternoon YouTubers, it's Mark, M0VST and I'd like to introduce you to the uh, the latest green radio that's uh, a snow in the shack. It's the PRC351 otherwise known as the RT351. Before I start the uh, the run through of the, of the transceiver I'd just like to say uh, a huge thanks to everyone that left nice comments and uh, subscribed to my channel. It's um, I can see that I'm not the only one on the planet that uh, likes green radio, so you guys are appreciated, and I try and to uh, I try to reply to all the, the comments. Thanks very much, guys. You you are appreciated. Right, we'll start on the back. This is the uh, the mount point to to uh, to put the three five one onto the uh, the backpack frame, which the three twenty is just sitting on at the moment. Um, and just the ID plate. This is the same battery as the three twenty. Alright, this is the external um, antenna output, so if you're not using this one, this is the mount for a whip, which I'll come to in a second. If you're using a, the GSA, the ground spike antenna, the, uh, the coax is attached here. This is the mount point for, um, I've got two different antennas for it here actually. One of them is, is a, uh, a flexible like battle whip, and it's got like a, a spigot on there. I'll just demonstrate how that mounts. It goes in and then turns and you can uh, do the nut up and it stops it from coming off. This also is uh, hinged, nicely notched, so if the radio is on its side you can still have the antenna pointing the right way. Also has a, uh, a solid whip like on the 320 with the same spigot. Right. Um, these are the decade switches which um, you, you pick your frequency, so as you now look through these little tiny keyways that have been took out, you can see we're, we're actually on 5200. Uh, zero, zero. This radio covers between 30 MHz and 75.975 FM with a maximum power of 4 watts. So these are, um, as you can see, I'm on, I'm on 5.2 at the moment, so that, that's 6 meters. If I turn the dial, there we go, we're now on um, 4 meters, I'm now on 70 megahertz. Um, the only thing that's different to this with the, uh, to do with this and the, and the uh, 321 and the 32, uh, 320 is the very bottom step is in 25 uh, kilohertz steps instead of, the, uh, instead of um, 10 like in the other one. Right, so this is the deco switches, so this is your frequency, where you pick the frequency here and the antenna sockets, and you can only use one at a time. Right, this is the uh, the main on and off switch. This is the dot, this is what will uh, explain what's going on here. So zero is off, W is whisper, L is loud, and, st and uh, star is noise on. Uh, as I turn it, so now on W, it makes it so the, um, the headset the volume into the headset is very quiet and it turns the gain right up on the microphone so you can actually whisper into it and uh, the gain is good, you still be heard. Loud is um, the opposite, it turns the headset very very loud and, and reduces the sensitivity to the microphone. And I'm, I'm think noise on is, is like, a, like a, I think it's an audio test so you can check your battery but I'm not 100% sure yet. Back to off. Right, so we've done the decade switches, the, the, the dial. This is a back plate which tells us um, the instructions. This side you can see it says remote switch. This remote switch is control if you're going to be operating the radio locally, whether a remote control or have it set on auto, auto rebroadcast or as an intercom, or you can call the other station. That plugs in, oh, that's settable here. So at the moment, through this little tiny notch, you can see it's on L, because I've got it on local. There will be um, remote control. There is auto rebroadcast. That's the intercom. And C is for call. I'll run through the rest of these functions in a bit more depth um, in the next video, probably. Um, this is the, uh, the terminal, so you can attach for to use it in auto rebroadcast or in remote control. You can have it so you can plug in um, 
three kilometers of cable it's called D10 and have a uh, like a telephone set just like this telephone here but there's a telephone set with two wire inputs here so you can remotely um, transmit with this radio and that's connected here um, you recognize these as the same as on the 320 and the 321 your audio sockets they're seven pin so you could do the same as what you have on the other radios you could have say a headset in here and a speaker in here or um, a, a CW uh, key in there and a, you could have one out to say the audio amp etc so you recognize those from the other from the previous videos all right I've gone through that that these and we're back to the back again so the mountain point it's uh, so this is the PRC351 I'll show you what the 352 looks like it's pretty simple right the 352 is basically the 351 with the 20 watt amplifier attached it's um it goes between, it sandwiches between the 351 and the battery. This is the RF output from the um, 351. You can see where it mounts on here, these are the terminals. And on this side we have the RF output and a switch, which uh, so you can flick it up between uh, the three sections of the bands. Um, T, I think, is tune. I'm not too sure for when you've got a. Um, I'm not too, actually too sure. I'm sure it's tune, but I'll have to look into more into this. And zero is off. I'll show you this mounted. I'll show you this mounted on the uh, the radio. All right. So there we have the constructed PRC three five two. This section is the three five one. This is the twenty watt amplifier. And there's the battery at the bottom. So basically. The only difference is it changes, it's the same frequency output, still 30 to 75, 975, but now instead of only uh, 4 watts on F FM, it's now got 20 watts on FM. A little bit heavier, but all this still, all this would mount to the same uh, frame as the 320 there. It's considerably lighter than the 320, I'll say that as well. So there you go, that is the run through, guys, of the um, PRC. 351 slash 2. Thanks very much for watching, and uh, you guys that, that leave comments, you are appreciated. And thanks for subscribing as well. Uh, this is M0VST Mark. Bye bye for now.